Hey guys, I wanted to give you a quick overview of the Bafong DPC-18. You might find this display panel on kits, or if you have a BB SO2, a BB SO1 driven electric bike like the Evelo Delta X here, um, it's a pretty cool display. It's color, it does uh, angle, so there's some adjustability there. This one has a USB type A, 5 volt, 500 milliamp charger built into the bottom. Really appreciate that. And then this is what the button pad looks like. It's got a plus, minus, lights, information and power. So to boot it up, you just hold that power key for a second, comes to life. You'll see the clock at the top left, a battery percentage, really appreciate that, much nicer than like a five tick infographic. Speed in the middle, right now it's miles per hour, and then watts on the outer rim. So that's pretty cool. So you can see how hard your motor is working. Trip distance is the default readout, but if we press that I button, it's gonna show us our odometer, our max speed, average speed, Range, range is really cool. So if I press the plus or minus keys here and go from zero up to one, it calculates and it says 40 miles based on how much battery is left over and how you've been riding. We go all the way up to level five, okay, it drops down to 27. Very cool. That combined with the battery percentage infographic is just really, really handy. And then we'll continue on to calories burned and time, and then it cycles back to trip distance. I really appreciate this display because it is fairly large, it's center mounted, it could be a little bit vulnerable because it's not removable, but there's a lot of adjustability that's built into the settings menu. And you can get there by pressing the I button twice quickly. Tap, tap. Okay, there we go, display settings. We can adjust the units, the brightness, auto off, so that's how long it waits until the display turns itself off. Maximum levels of pedal assist, so we can go from five up to nine or down to three to simplify. Five's pretty good, those are nice increments. Power view, you can also change this over to uh, current view uh, instead of, so we were talking about the watts before. Um, state of charge, percent, or we can change that to uh, voltage. It's kind of neat. So there's just a lot of advanced readouts on this. Trip reset, wheel diameter. This one has 27.5 inch plus size tires, so we're just gonna leave it at 27. Speed limit, 30 miles per hour. That's pretty neat, so you can adjust this. Some people wanna go a little bit slower and feel safer, so that's nice as well. And then this is the ambient light sensitivity, so there is a little light sensor built in. It can activate headlights. This bike, the Delta X, it does have a built-in headlight, so that's a really cool feature if you just want the bike to sort of manage itself. Uh, password, so you can lock the display out, set clock, and back. There's even an information section here that gives you feedback about the battery and error code. So if you're trying to self-diagnose or maybe before you call a shop to get help, it's just great that you have access to that sort of information. I think that's about it. Uh, John was telling me that Evelo has done a really good job translating and preparing a manual uh, that supports this display and I'll be linking to that in the forum so people can kind of share their experiences or tips and tricks and then also have just probably the simplest, most intuitive guide to work with. As always, have fun out there and ride safe.